everybody. Some old man back again. We're getting things finished up here in the uh, in the strawberry patch or future strawberry patch. I've been bringing in loads of uh, gravel and uh, garden soil as you can see. I've already finished the first tier or first level and getting ready to uh, rake out the second level. So uh, you can see what I'm doing here is I've got a planting area where I'll put strawberries in which will be easily pickable standing below, leaning in, and then I have a walking area to walk and access each level without having to actually walk in the strawberry patch itself. And this stuff is far enough back that it'd be more difficult to reach from down below anyway, so it all makes sense. But I'm uh, just trying to get everything smoothed out. And there's nothing really keeping the, uh, the dirt and uh, stone from mixing except for uh, the fact that they're kind of not going to have a real reason to mix because there's not an awful lot of churn between the two different uh, stuff. But I just uh, thought I'd do a quick video today to show how this all turned out. Whoa! <laughs> Gonna be a little bit of a mess like that, but that's okay. I truthfully have uh, probably six or so bags of, uh, uh, of gravel, and uh, well, the gravel I've got uh, five more bags from my big uh, 40 bag load that I originally started with. But the uh, grab the topsoil, I've got six more bags. And I'll probably need one more small bag here in this uh, second tier. The third one was not going to take that much, but I'm not going to do that today because I've really got to clean up the uh, the pine needles and weeds and everything up in that area. I'll probably do that in the next few days. Meanwhile, I'll just stash all the extra material here in the backyard. And when I get ready to need it, I will uh, just uh, pull it out and put it in. In the meantime, you can see that these planting areas are actually going to look pretty good. And I can't wait till spring when I can actually get the strawberries to put them in. Can't put them in now, of course, because it's hot and dry and not enough time for them to root even if I did irrigate them before uh, fall shows up. Get them in the spring, and by the time fall of 2022 rolls around, this stuff will be well established and you'll never get them out. At least that's the plan. Well, that's all I got for today. Just a really quick short one. I may add something else uh, up at the computer. I may not, it just depends. So if I don't, just go ahead and remember the routine. Subscribe, hit the like button bell icon and leave a comment if need be that's all i got for right now so some old man signing off